Tonight is very important. Oh, maybe we came at a bad time. Well, there's only one way to find out. Donald! Now then, Monsieur, Mademoiselle, please enjoy the evening. And of course, our honored guests are welcome too. A uh, welcome indeed. The organization! You don't know when to quit. Oh yeah, well, sure, yeah. Get out! Not tonight. I've come to take something you hold very dear. Yes, let your anger glow. Beast, we have to get rid of these guys first. Get out! Give me strength! Yeah.
You just had to have a party, didn't you? Don't you see what's happened? Hey, what's with you? The rose. My rose. What? That? He took it? But surely you can find another rose. Silence! You don't know anything! That's not fair, Beast. Don't take it out on Belle. It's not like she stole it. <sighs> I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. But... Belle... Sora... I want you to leave the castle. Look at me. Look. This is what I am. When you first got here, I tried to change. But I was only fooling myself. I can't be any different. I'll always be a beast. So I should live like a beast. With no one alone. Goodbye, Belle. You can't mean that. Oh, I think his mind's all made up. Yeah. Look, Belle. Leave this to us. If we can get the beast's rose back, he'll calm down. Hey, beast! <sighs> Leave me alone. Come on, you need to hear this. You used to be fearless. You would have given your life to save Belle. Don't you know what that meant to us? You gave us all courage! Hmm. <laughs> Maybe you should have kept some for yourself. I mean, are you really gonna throw your happiness away? The Rose is your only hope, isn't it? Well, it's the only hope for Cogsworth and the others, too. So don't throw away your last chance. Remember what it was like before Belle lived here? See? You can't give up. Not now. I know one thing. What? This castle belongs to me. Zaldin will never be welcome here.
After all, you had me worried. I was afraid you'd given up for good. What do you guys really want? Kingdom Hearts. When Kingdom Hearts is ours, we can exist fully and completely. Huh? So you see, Beast, that's why we need your Heartless and your Nobody. Oh, it's 
It's over! Back off! Back off! Is that? Look! It's the rose! Rather travel light. What shall I leave behind? Bell or the rose? Good one, Bell. Get out! <laughs> 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 
Fun in this. We stop Get out! Light. We stop Fun in this. We stop Beast! Get out! Give me strength! We stop me! Yep! Yo! 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 Yo!
Here, it's yours again. Belle? I know. You want me to leave the castle. <sighs> what matters is, you weren't hurt by Zaldin. You're safe. And, um, I'm very grateful to you for bringing the Rose back to me. Hmm. Thank you. It's the least I could do. You've been good to me, and you didn't have to be. Listen, Belle. Yes? <sighs> oh. Say it. Go on. Come on. You can do it. We have confidence. Don't be bashful, Mal. Well, I'd like you to stay with me, please. I will. My strong music. Hey, did you see the look on Belle's face when she grabbed that rose? Huh? Yup, she sure was having fun, all right. She is rather unique, isn't she? Always ready for a little adventure. The two of them do seem made for each other. Yeah, they sure do.
Uh, Zola, some assistance? That's Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Will you leave a mate to perish? Aye, aye. him. Will, wake up. Elizabeth. What happened? The medallions and the stone chest. 
Someone's taken them. Next thing I knew, we were attacked. But I couldn't see who it was. His face was shrouded in a black hood. The organization? We found a way out of the cave. But the villain sent a horde of terrible creatures after us. I've never seen their likes before. I think I'm the only one who made it back to the ship. Will! Elizabeth, I feel rather... Uh... Our turn, guys. You'd best go prepared. We've no idea what's out there. Pardon me, lads and lass, but your captain will have no monsters today. Thank you. We're turning for home. Just like that? Just like that. Don't remember inviting you. So it was the organization. We'll handle this. Huh? The darkness of men's hearts. Drawn to these cursed medallions. And this heartless. A veritable maelstrom of avarice. I wonder, are they worthy to serve Organization 13? You want an answer now? Precisely. Overboard. Aye, aye. Holly! Excuse me? Orly? It's a bit of a pirate's code. Anyone who invokes parley must not be harmed till negotiations are complete. This is no time for rules. Uh, true. But as we're honorable pirates, we should always stick to the code. All right, you. Out with it. I surrender the chest with my humblest apologies. Rather accommodating of you, mate. And for that you want... Just a few souvenirs. For the memories. Huh? Oh no! We can't stop the curse unless we got all the medallions! Our friend's about to learn what it means to cross a pirate. Oh. Sora, Donald, Goofy, he's yours.
You stole a medallion again? Were I only that fortunate? Fortunate? So, uh, how come you're all skeleton-y? Perhaps I got a touch of something from that monster what attacked us. Yet, why is the skin resting right on you three? Cause we're not greedy! What do you get to that? That still doesn't solve the mystery. Gorge. Maybe the reason we're all okay is because we're not from this world. There must be different laws. Yeah. We're always just passing through. Wonder when we'll see home again. Sure. <laughs> just kidding you. Lucky we didn't get cursed, huh? Quit yammering, mates. We've got to find ourselves a ship that'll float. To go. How do you know? A pirate must have a keen eye. 
Else he won't be sailing free for very long, Savvy? Ridiculous imitation, and yet, I'm flattered. Oh! <laughs> 